All right, so what we have here is something I dug out of the freezer. Johnsville Cheddar Brats. We're going to, uh, we're going to make them like loaded boats. So uh, let me show you how to do that. Let's get these cut out and then we'll go from there. All right, so I got them out of the pack. Now I'm going to do is I'm going to sand them up on end and I want to start like right there and just pierce the skin, the casing coming down. And I want to stop right about there, not quite in the in the center and then open this up. And you'll see cheddar inside. All right. That's how I want those to go. Okay? You kind of push the ground around so it makes a canoe. Okay? Do that again right like so right into there and just cut stop just short there all right push her push and open so it makes a canoe all right well now we've got them all done let's get them over here to the blackstone all right now we're just going to set them down, face down. Okay. Both sides down. All right. And they say we're up to 300 degrees. So we're okay, rolling. so you see we added some more because I had another pack to cook, but I just did these as regular brats. So we'll just roll these over. And we'll push them out of the way here. We'll put them to the back. Now these ones. So you see we got some good browning right there, right? These are the ones we want to mess with. Don't pay attention to the brats in the back. Okay. Now these ones. They're going to be cooked on the edges and the insides will be cooked. Now we want to just flip them. You see that? And we'll kind of open it up a little bit. Now it'll cook on this side here. Okay. See how the canoes are starting, how it's starting to look like a canoe? I put the lid down just to trap some of that heat to make it like an oven so it'll start to cook the sides and everything. All good. Let's take a look here. Ooh, those look good. Let me pull this lid off. Well, I pull the lid off because it's underneath the, I got a microwave up here. So let's take a temp. See, we're at 145. Let's go in through the bottom, like the center right here. We're at a 136, right there. Let's come in through here to make sure we're good. We're at a 127. So we got just a, just a hair longer on these sides. We're at a one, 140 on the side that hasn't been on the temp heat, heat yet. Alright, so let's check them. It's been a few more minutes. One forty nine. You see I'm just barely going in there. One forty seven. There I'm going all the way a little deeper. 160, 140, let's see, right there where it doesn't look like it's done, 156, let's pull these off, alright, so let's build these bad boys, so first I'm going to take two brats, brat boats, 
set them up like this. Okay. Now I'm going to take some Palmetto Pimento Cheese. This is the brand you buy. If you're buying it, buy this brand. Yep. The jalapeno, they have a jalapeno, bacon, and original, and you can't, and a pepper jack. And let me tell you, you can't really go wrong with either. Now you can stuff this back in the Blackstone and, or nuke it in the microwave, not on the cast iron, to melt the cheese, but the heat from the brat's going to do that for me, I think. Okay. Alright, now I'm going to take some hot pepper jelly. I usually use a jalapeno jelly, but I'm all out. So this hot, this red pepper jelly, really good. And what I want to do is I want to put that right on top. Use my fork here to... Kind of spread it out a little bit. All right, can use a little more right there. Okay, same here. Okay, top with a little bit of real bacon. There we go. There we have it. So uh, let's get up here and get a taste test. All right, let's cut into this, see what she does. Wow. You get that broth taste, right? Then you get that pimento cheese creaminess. Mm. Then that pepper jelly Ooh, gives a nice little sweetness. And then there's a little bit of heat in the back end, just a little bit from the pimento cheese with the jalapenos. And then that pepper jelly. Mm. And then the bacon just gives it a good texture. Just adds a little salty texture to it phenomenal y'all give it a try i'm not sure what i'm gonna call this but uh maybe a southern twist on stuffed brat i don't know stuffed brats i don't know but y'all have a great week and we will catch you on the next one rock on y'all are awesome have a great week all right so let's get a little taste test hey you can't see me at all